Praise be to Jesus. Cardinal Kupich removes faculties from traditional priests accused of misconduct but found innocent. A Chicago Catholic priest heading a traditional parish, and a wonderful one at that, this is where I live, uh, parish community removed by Cardinal Blaise Kupich in March will not be allowed to return to his parish or religious order despite his exoneration for alleged misconduct. The review board has conducted, concluded that Father Phillips has not violated any secular, criminal, civil, or canon law, the group's June 20th statement said. Father Phillips, having been exonerated thusly, and this in turn confirmed by the votum of the Reverend, Right Reverend Jean Sarbzarek, um, Provincial Superior of the Congregation of the Resurrection, upon receipt of the Review Board Review. We now prayerfully await the response of His Eminence Blaise Cardinal Kupich, Archbishop of Chicago, for the return of our pastor, the group stated. Well, there's uh, quite a bit to this history here, but anyway, Steve, uh, Steve Skojek wrote on 1 Peter 5 of the March announcement, but it has been long been expected. Ever since Kupich took over America's third largest diocese, that he would follow his earlier track record as a bishop hostile to tradition and make a move against St. John Cassius. Remember, Skojak said, this is a man who, as Bishop of Rapid City, South Dakota, physically locked the doors of a traditional parish and pulled communion with the diocese during the Easter Tridum to keep them from worshiping God in the way they believe was most pleasing to him. So, um, I really don't know what to say other than this is really upsetting. I've listened to homilies by this man in the cathedral downtown and just the hair would just stand up on my head the way he twisted the gospel. Um, but uh, the link's in the description box if you want to read about this. <laughs> 